Have you ever wanted to get one inch away from a crocodile without getting eaten? In this video, we'll show you how to make the most of a day at Zoo Miami. What exhibits are a must see and which areas are most toddler and parent friendly? Hey everyone, we're here at Zoo Miami and we're gonna see what this is like for an almost two year old. We're so excited. This is supposed to be an amazing zoo. Vesper, are you excited for the zoo? The first exhibit we're gonna do is Mission Everglades and this I'm so excited for because they have this slide tunnel thing that goes underneath the crocodile exhibit. So you can see the crocodiles up above you. So excited to go in there with Vesper. And it is a hot day and it looks like we're gonna rent one of these safari cycles because it's super, super hot and the zoo is really big. So let's see how that goes with our little kiddos. Safari cycles can be rented online ahead of time, which is recommended if you're going to be here on a weekend. We would recommend these cycles for families with kids age two and up. If you only have a few hours at the zoo, no worries. Just visit Mission Everglades, the closest exhibit to the entrance. You'll get up close and personal with crocodiles, alligators, and eagles. This area is really, really cute. It's really fun for kids because there are these bridges over this alligator pond and you can look for the alligator. We actually arrived here at 11, the zoo opens at 10, and I was actually worried it was gonna be really crowded, but so far it is super not crowded yet, so maybe because it's a really hot day, and it's also a weekday. We're going in the crocodile tunnel, I'm so excited. Slide like an otter. Let's see what this is like. so perfect for hanging out with kids for a whole day. Look in the Everglades exhibit right at the beginning. They even have this beautiful playground for kids. And right now it's just Vesper and her cousin. Like I think you could definitely spend half a day just in this first exhibit that's like not a walk at all from the entrance. Because there's the otter slide, there's the crocodile tunnel, and there's these two beautiful playgrounds. And they even are selling, like there's a little bar here, which is so, it's amazing. We're going into the Amazon Oasis on our bike. That's right, you having fun? Uh, fun. Aw, yeah. Now we're gonna go into the Amazon Oasis. Sorry if I look a little ghosty because I had to pack on the sunscreen. <gasps> Amazon Oasis has an extensive collection of colorful snakes, lizards, and frogs in beautiful terrariums. It also has a huge forest area with beautiful vegetation and fascinating animals like giant otters. Another unforgettable activity at the Miami Zoo is giraffe feeding. Now we're gonna go feed the giraffes. This is gonna be super fun. Hey, Such an amazing day awesome. at Zoo Miami. This was definitely like a 10 out of five for toddlers. It was an amazing place to explore. We only got to like maybe a quarter of the zoo. So you could spend probably a whole week here actually. Yeah. It's amazing, we just fed the giraffes. And definitely my favorite part was the Everglades part. That was really, really cool. So we highly recommend Zoo Miami. If you're in Florida for anything, definitely come see it. 
it's amazing and renting the rickshaw thing was definitely or the surrey i think it's called was definitely worth it so thanks for watching this video everybody please leave a comment if you have a favorite place to visit in florida bye, bye. Next, where to find dolphins and the best key lime pies in the Florida Keys. Thanks for watching and please make sure to subscribe so you don't miss our next videos. It's a good